Where hell are they? The real value of this space is the outdoor play space you can see behind me. And all of the things that that can, that can nurture, such as metalwork, woodwork, mechanics, um, printmaking. Um, we've got ideas to put in a cafe. We've got ideas to continue with our bike exchange. And all those things are activities that we're going to really bring through with, with the children and young people. So hopefully in the future there's going to be a load of kids and young people who feel really confident working with their hands and also confident and happy to be outdoors and meeting people away from their screens and computers. We are this playground! <laughs>First day that I went to her most, I was feeling so nervous, so anxious. It was really nice and I thought, oh that wasn't so bad. I didn't know what to expect. It was a fear of the unknown. It was like, that just showed me unconditional love, genuine love, like you know, they actually want me to do good. They actually sat down and listened to me and offered real advice, not textbook advice from different places and not, they just treated you like a human. And I thought, wow, this place is amazing. I think you get used to, you get used to talking about yourself, you get, that is part of your recovery. I love Hamos because it, it, it's gave me everything that I never really had. I'm just sitting with myself and enjoying being me. It's really nice.